guys I'm having breakfast let me finish this wow. amazing breakfast have everything you want everything you see good morning guys this is Mara I just had my breakfast I didn't film that much because I didn't have much time now I'm gonna meet a friend right here I'm staying in this very beautiful hotel actually one of my fan who has been watching me for years booked this place for me for three nights with breakfast I wanna say thank you so much bro you're watching this I know you don't have be in videos or anywhere I wanna say thank you so this is my other friend his name is Luis. Luis, man! How are you, man? The magician of Kenya. Uh, the what? The what? The what? The magician. The magician? Yeah, magician. Why? 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 <laughs> I, what's the. Uh, this you, is Luis. Hey, let's go, man. Seriously, what's the odd? That we met on Mexico and then, then we, we meet here. Yeah. It's crazy, well, bro. One chance in that. And me, because yeah. I was about to leave the country. Oh. That's my la I told myself, yeah, I am leaving in the beginning of July. Yes. And I, I go to leave some other country. Yes. But then I, I said, no, let's stay one more month. Yeah. And then you are here. Oh, that's what you did? Yes. So, wait, uh, do I need something? I don't know. I've carried, I've carried my, my passport. What else do I need? Uh, that's uh, that's so that's okay. that's all yeah. and some money that's okay now yeah. all right hey man Luis this is your home bro yeah so this guy is from Belgium welcome to Brussels guys so Luis man tell people who you are because people yes, uh, okay the, okay the... okay you know I'm excited at the same time I'm so I'm 733 733 732 11. right on top there yeah 11 so so how do we go 11 Luxembourg so guys we are leaving one country to the next country by a train and me and Luis we are going with no plan so actually let me explain a little bit maybe we should go back Luis where did we meet bro <laughs> tell them the story because you know every day the channel gets new subscribers okay yeah yeah they don't know the, the story uh -huh. we met we met 9,000 kilometers away, away from, from here. Me. Imagine. We met in Mexico, uh -huh. Puerto Escondido. Puerto Small Escondido. Town yeah. On the beach. In the morning, I was alone. Yeah. And then Mahua came and said, hey, bro. What's, what's up? up? <laughs> <laughs> you see, talking to people can open the world. You know, people always say, ah, I don't know that guy. Why should I even talk to them? But again, man. So Luis was sitting in the beach very early in the morning and the sunrise was 715. Yes. Alright. This is Luis man. He's wearing Gucci. Luis, this is Gucci. Yeah, from Dubai. From Dubai? <laughs> yeah, I was going to Dubai in the beginning of July, but then I said no, let's stay. Wow. Wow, then so Mara is here. We, we did almost. Yeah, this is, no, it's, it's energy. Yes, it's yeah. energy. It's, it's like there's something we need to do, yeah. we've not done. Yeah, exactly, you know? Exactly, exactly. So, so, so we have to do it. Well, I can't actually imagine. You know, Luis told me he's from Brass, he's from Port not Portugal, he's from Belgium. I didn't know which part of Belgium because Belgium is big. But this again, is my city, my school, my, when I was little, my school was there. You know? oh, oh. Every day I, w I went to the station go to go to school. Every single day. Yeah. These are the trains you're gonna take. This one. Oh, this one here. It's kind of cold. Yeah. yeah so it's cold. We are, we are used to. <laughs> oh, and imagine this is summer. Yes. So I can imagine winter. And you're lucky. I'm you're, lucky. Yeah, you're lucky. Why? Look on the internet. Summer of last year, there was flood and many people died. Here? Yeah, in the Belgium, uh, Germany. Oh, yeah, I remember I yeah. remember actually there's uh, some flood actually, yeah. Yeah, yeah it was, uh, it was, <coughs> it rained, it rained. I mean, it was crazy day, man. Man, you know, you know the hotel I'm staying? Yes. Uh, one of my subscribers is paying, is paying for me there. 
okay. and it has breakfast. So I've eaten breakfast, man. I don't know if you're hungry or you. Okay. I don't eat in the morning. You don't eat in the morning. No. Yeah, I remember something like that also when I met you. Yeah, yeah. I am doing the Kenyan, uh, the Maasai thing of taking black coffee with butter and cocoa. That and is it. That's it, and it cut the. You know, you don't feel angry for yeah. hours and oh. you have energy. Oh, oh, wow, man. You guys, had, did you hear something about that? So anyway, Luis, I met this guy, 9,000, is it miles or kilometers? Kilometers. Kilometers away in the beach somewhere in Mexico. He was sitting somewhere like there, somewhere, let's say there. I walked up to him and said, bro, so this is, imagine this is the ocean. So he's sitting somewhere here in the in the yellow line. I said, bro, what's up, man? My name is Maru. I'm from Kenya, Africa. Where are you from? He said, I'm from Belgium. I said, mm, black person in Belgium. I was so surprised. Actually, you know, before then, yeah. I didn't know there were black people in, in <laughs> there Europe. There were so many. <laughs> yeah, now I, I see. Even there's a kid right there. It makes stress. Even the ones that are coming in. Oh, let me see this other side. Wow, you see? So we are going we are going to another country called Luzen Luxembourg. Hey man, Europe and trains is crazy man. Yeah, yeah, there is a ticket, it's yeah. 300 euro and you can travel uh, but it's for you if you need to be under 26 years old, you buy that ticket and you can travel. Oh wherever you want. You have to be under 26 years old. Yeah, it's a special, you know, discount oh. for young people to visit Europe. Oh. So you can take the train from... I, I met a girl in here, in this yeah. place, in this train station, on, waiting the train. Yeah. And she said, yeah, I am from Norway mm -hmm. and... Uh, Let me give you like this, so, so because of the light. She bought that ticket. Yeah. And she was traveling all over with her sister. Wow, she from was Norway. From all country, from Norway, yeah. Sweden, and all the Europe. Wow, man. I'm it's really well connected. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I realized. Like, you can actually travel by train, yeah. like the entire Europe. Yeah, if you take the train, the 7 o'clock train, uh -huh. you arrive at 12 in Switzerland. I, I used to go to Switzerland like this. 12 today today you can arrive in switzerland today if you take the train at 7 7 a.m yeah. or 7 in the in the 7 in the morning yeah at tw uh, past 12 you're in switzerland in basel wow yeah. i used to take the train like i used to go to switzerland like this wow so switzerland is not far away from here no it's a couple of hours oh damn. It's, it's a nice train because it's uh it's the i the train we will take now, it's not high speed, it's, it's a normal train. Oh. But the train that goes to Switzerland, it's high speed. High speed. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Man, I can't believe I'm meeting Luis here. And, and we were with him in Mexico. We were planning a lot of businesses then. I became three busy. But you saw I opened the clothes. I don't know if you see this. this no, is I saw you walk on your house and that's it. No, this is also my brand, Luis. Man, it's called Soft Life. You remember when you challenged me? This guy, oh, yes. this guy told me, what are you selling? You need to pay me a lot of money because you're wasting a lot of money. Now, this is my brand, man. I'm selling online. I, I make this, Louis. Amazing. Not just one, different. You have a, wow, it's amazing. A lot, a lot. Actually, even I have an Instagram page now dedicated just to my clothes. You yeah, guys, that's, that's what you, you yeah, yeah. No, you guys. Please go, 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 go on the US. You can have these clothes, both male and female, Louis. Oh, even amazing. you, you can actually order right now and you get for ten thousand dollars here yes you get your clothes actually the price is like five thousand dollars but the problem is shipping is like from uh, 40 euros to 60 euros it depends so that's why the clothes we make them okay. not, we, we make them a hundred hundred euros hundred euros for this all this uh -huh. that is they arrive at your door great okay Okay, so where are we so going to then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you know, you t this guy told me, you need to pay me. He told me I need to pay him money <laughs> yeah, yeah. because I am wasting money. I am not seeing the opportunity. Yeah, yeah, you leave money on the table. <laughs> <laughs> this man used to leave uh, money on the table, but now he's not Louis, leaving any money on uh, the table. Now I'm collecting everything, Luis. Now I'm like a pasta, man. It's called, you collect everything. It's great, it's great. So, Luis, where are we going? Luxembourg. Luxembourg. So, Guys, Luxembourg is a different country from where we are. I told Luis I only have one day to see this country and he said, okay man, we, we're gonna go. You know one thing I, I really like about you? 
is you live off the greed you are not yeah, in the line no, no, no. because if you're in the line today you'll say man i have a work today no, in the morning no, no, no. and you said for how long have you been doing this man you have to design your life you know i have an office you know yeah but it's um like it's a um, co-working office and they're yeah. everywhere in the world so i can go to my office in brussels i can go in mexico city with the same car like i've one car wow. it opened the door in all the office all over the world you know we oh, work yeah yeah, yeah. Company. i can work uh, in all those places in Guys, bangkok did you hear that that he has one card he can go to different offices around the world yeah the it's, called, work office, yes. it's called the we work office yes just one card yeah. you can go anywhere and yeah you have your yeah. office yeah when i was in mexico i went to yes. work mexico when yeah. i go to dubai i go to dubai no yeah. need to you no know, no i work if i want to work in the morning i go office in the morning if i want to go in the afternoon i go in the afternoon okay guys our train is uh, actually it's seven now my watch is uh, one hour ahead it's 7 14. Yeah, 20, we have 20 let me uh, a little bit let me ask uh, let me ask luis about uh, the last girl he was supposed to date in mexico man you remember her <laughs> at the train station now so guys we just arrived in luxembourg we're gonna explore here but my guy here tells me something bro what are you saying well, we can do three countries because we start in Brussels, Belgium, now yeah. we are in Luxembourg and we are really close to Germany. So we can do, and we are also close from the Netherlands, so we can maybe do three countries. Wow! Like from here we can actually keep going a little bit far and we are in Germany. Yeah, there is, I think we are one, you know Metz is a French city, it's really close from uh, Luxembourg. Metz? Yes. Wow! Which is a German Germany or French? French, French city. Wow, so we can do three countries <laughs> in a day. <laughs> in a day yeah. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we just arrived at the terminal. Wow, bro. Wow. Bro, that's crazy, bro. Three countries in one day. Three countries in one day. <laughs> that's cruising. <laughs> that's really big travel. Yeah. Welcome to Luxembourg. Welcome to Luxembourg. Now I need to, we need to get out. I can't believe I'm here, bro. New country in my life. It's too hot outside. It 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 feels very okay, right? It, yeah. it has medium temperate temperatures. Let me put this one here. Oh, better. Sorry. Cigarettes. Oh, oh, what say? Somebody told me also in Belgium there is like good. I don't know good. Uh, uh, what was it? Is it wine? No, chocolate. Beer, beer. beer and chocolate. Yeah. Oh, she has some beers here. Yes. Let's. One my friend in Luxembourg. Oh, let me see what's going on here. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. That's nice. Ah. So this is the most popular one here? It's, oh, it's popular nice. in Brussels. In Brussels, oh. yeah. Delirium is a famous bar. Man, we're yes. gonna have one. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Man. Yes, thank you. Th thank you so much. Let's go, man. This way. I'm sorry. Officially. Introducing you, Luxembourg. Uh, that lady had, had beer. Yeah, Delirium is a famous bar. Wow. Wow. I think she likes our vibe. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You should ask her if she needs help to carry, but it's all good. 
So, uh, what are the recommendations to do here in Luxembourg, madam? What are the recommendations to do here in Luxembourg? Oh, ajuda. Je parle français. Oh, si espagnol. Moi, je parle français, pas lui. We're asking for recommendations. Okay. There are a lot of people who are going to visit the museum. I've already visited it. You've already visited it more than me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. From Kenya, he and I are from Kenya. From Kenya, yeah, I'm from Kenya. You're from Kenya, right? You're from Kenya, right? You're from Kenya, right? You're from Kenya, right? Yes. First time in Europe. Ah, okay. You've already visited it. First time. Luxembourg, so you're telling her it's my first time in Europe. I'm really excited. These are the trains here. Something funny with Europe is they have trains, inter trains, inter countries, you know. So she has told you something? Huh? What, no, recommendation? She doesn't, she doesn't know. She to visit oh, she came to visit too? And All right, so let's go on here. Huh? Let's just get lost. But a friend told me what to visit anyway. No, I, I have a, a subscriber who told me, hey, if... Can you send me the list in the train? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. Luxembourg. I want to take a nice picture for my Instagram. Please, guys, go follow us on Instagram. Check my guy here, man. Hey, shout out yourself, bro, man. You know, we're in a new country. In like one day, we've done two countries, bro. Yeah, we've done And we are country. planning to do three. You know? Wow, you, Europe, when they say free movement, they mean free movement. Look, you arrive in a new country and nobody cares. Yeah, nobody cares. Even we got Germany, nobody cares. Imagine. Yeah. Other countries in Africa, you can't move even from yeah, one spot to another. Yeah, I know. That's why I don't go a lot in Africa. In Africa. Wow, man, I need a picture, very nice picture here because this is gonna introduce me. And, and you know, yeah. after this, we're gonna do a live stream. Okay, but let, let's walk this way. No, I want this, man. It's my first impression, bro. You know, you, you've been coming here many times. Yeah, I stay in this hotel normally. You, st you stay in this hotel? Yeah, the hotel there. It's expensive or 50-50? It's ex uh, expensive. Yeah, because it's next to... The train but station. I just stay one night, so it's okay. It's 70 euro. You, okay, so because we filmed a video before with you, but this time I, I wanna teach you how we're gonna film this video. Okay. Me in this video, I wanna be like a baby. Yeah. So I'm excited to see everything. Oh, look at that! Look at this! Oh, look at this! Oh shit! Oh, I missed. I missed that, man. How did I miss that? I missed that. Ah, I hope another one comes. Oh, damn, man. Wow, looks so good. So, okay, let's go. What's up, guys? This is Mara. We are in Luxembourg. And uh, we walk in cold. It's a bit cold, but I like that fresh wind. You know, it's wind plus the sun, so you feel beautiful, man. This is one of the smallest, one of the smallest countries we have in Europe. They are building, building, building. I love that noise. When I hear that, I know the world is becoming better and better and better. So here they have like buses. You see, like that's a beautiful bus. Let me show them this place, man. I'm using this video here. Then we go this way, man. I'm sorry, bro. So look at this. This is a tram, right? Yes. Yeah. This is a tram. Looks and bad. Wow. Welcome to Europe. Welcome to Europe. This is a very, very small country, man. Super small. People are driving Mercedes Benz. You know, I've come to realize. This format where you have a railway and still the road and still everything, you know? Yeah. Like, it's lack of space, but they ensure everything coexists, you know? Mm -hmm. Wow. It's my first time here, man. 
one of my fans told me I should come to Luxembourg and uh, really? yeah 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 in my comments maybe I should call her she said hey we're in Luxembourg come here Maru we can show you around yeah I think if I don't write her she's gonna feel so bad because uh, I told her I am here you know guys please subscribe to the channel please please let's get this channel 400,000 subscribers that's one thing I have now to start emphasizing because honestly I don't want to leave Europe without hitting 400,000 and also my friend here man give yourself a shout out man maybe yeah well you can like, like this because of the Sun I want people to see you yes well I run a YouTube channel about yes. Yes. I run a channel for digital nomads, you can follow it, it's called uh, Soulful Nomad. And also gonna put the links right here. Yes. Please guys check him, we met with him in Mexico and now we are here. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day in Luxembourg. Just amazing man. That's where you parking in Hadison. Oh yeah, I'm staying in a hotel just like the one here but in a different country where we just came. Man, you're selling. We can take a train in the next 15 minutes and we're in France. Yeah. Three countries in one day. Three countries. Yeah, man, that's what I want to do. I want to travel like crazy. I just want to be unpredictable, man. You know? But mess, mess is really smaller than here. Smaller than. But you can still go, man. Let's fast walk and see. Yes. So this is Luxembourg. Um. So you see, we are already at the end of the city, the city center. We are at the end already? Yeah. This is it? Yeah. That's so, so one hour here, you can actually do a trip and just like... Yeah, but there is the old town. Yes. And it's different. Now it's the modern town. Now we go to the old town. Okay. So this is the modern town where they have glasses like mine. They're selling them. Also, here they use euros, right? Yes. Wow, you know one thing I love about Europeans yeah. huh, is how they make their life easy. Like they make things soft for their kids. Uh -huh. They have buses, they have trams. Look how they make their streets, man. Very, very nice. You know? Though, you can also find something like that. She's asking for some money, man. So, ATM, ATM. Everywhere ATM, man. Wow. Just like... Three minutes walk, we are at the end of the city center. The city center. It's finished. This is the old town. Uh, this is the this is the place where if if you break up with your girlfriend, you are hundred percent sure you may end up meeting. Actually, it has happened. It's it's happened to yeah, you. Yeah, to one of my friends. It's oh, happened. tell me a story, man. So I was supposed to meet uh, this woman from France, and we met here. Yeah. And then we go to a bar. Yeah. And the guy working at the bar. He was the ex-boyfriend. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, welcome to Luxembourg. The thing is that yes. when you want to meet some here it's really easy to there's a lot of party, you go to club. Yeah. But there are not many clubs. So oh, you always meet the same people. Oh, it's I see. like a family. Oh, I see your point, man. You see the same people all the time. I love their buses, man. Very chill. Very nice. Wow, Sean Paul was here. Oh, it's coming on the 3rd of July. When is today? Whoa, okay, it's passed. He was here on 3rd of July, man. Wow, Luxembourg. And you told me people speak different languages here, right? Yeah, German and French and, and a bit of Dutch and there are a lot of Portuguese people here. Oh, wow. So, and, and so, like you see people are little born they are Portuguese. Wow, wow. Really a lot. So most people here are Dutch or are French. How yeah, can this you? This is a mix of everything. Oh wow! Looks and bag. Very very nice. Fifty percent sell. They're selling that fifty percent now. Yeah, now it's the one month of sale, so it will last for one month all over Europe. Oh, everything goes down. Yeah. Because it's summertime. Yeah. Wow. So Guys, now we have the old part. So now we just finished the modern Luxembourg. Yeah. Now we're gonna hit the old part. We're gonna walk there like a few hours, then coming back, I'm gonna do a live stream. Yeah, maybe we could spread the view is better. All right, thank you, bro. So, how many times have you been here? I don't know, many times. Wow, Luxembourg. This is a country in. Oh, this guy just crossed without me realizing. 
but I'm saying this is a country in Europe. <laughs> so, so let me do this. Let me give you. Let me give you facts about Luxembourg. This is the real streets here, man. Very, very nice country. Chill, vibe, nice. Ah, Europe. That's why people are running to Europe, bro. People driving Porsche, Porsche Cayenne, BMW. What else? Okay, this kind of looks regular Volkswagen. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Now we're gonna go to the old town. But before then, let me give you a little fact about Luxembourg. Give the video a like, subscribe to the channel. 400,000 men, Europe to the world now. So guys, as we walk around Luxembourg, one of the richest countries in Europe actually, right? Yes. Uh, my friend here, uh, I almost lived here. You almost lived here? Yeah. Because it's very close to your, to yeah. your, to, to your home. The, the hands yeah. are not uh, good. Uh, no, it's not really expensive, the rent. Oh, the rent is not so expensive. No. And one thing I've just realized is the minimum wage, the minimum wage of... Uh, good, bro. Uh, of Luxembourg is uh, 2,300 euros as per now. Minimum wage. Minimum wage is but officially by the government if you work per month that's the least money you can take home at the end of the month 2300 euros the population here is uh, 600,000 646,000 and uh, the system here is everything government system look they're cleaning their roads man are they cleaning or maintaining yeah you look serious people huh they take time they ensure everything is functioning. It's a lighting system. Uh, they, are, they, are, they are changing that. They are changing the, you know? And they're using machines, man. Yeah. Just, see, you just fixed it, man. You know, when I show this video, my idea is other people can learn, can see how other people live yes. and be better and see how the roads are created look how people build eh? how they they clean their grass and their buses and cars moving and the level of organization uh -huh. that's why i treasure my channel a lot yes. and my good thing about my channel is i don't cut videos too much that i only show the good part i show you everything so you can decide for yourself man oh this was nice this was like this so the parliamentary system here, the government here, it's monarch, it's parliamentary system, it's democracy. It has all types of governmental systems here. So there is kind of a prime minister, there is a king here, there is everything here in, in Luxembourg. Wow, look at this. That's cost. That car cleans the city. I want you guys to see this car. Like this car right here. It cleans the city. Look, 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 look. Hey. Wow. So that car cleans the city. Instead of uh, putting people cleaning, cleaning here and there, and they don't do a good job, you can easily find a car like that and you clean the entire city quick. And it moves very fast, very powerful. Look. <laughs> you see that? They have a car which can clean the entire city. And you go to other to other people's country, you find people cleaning. You don't need that. Find a machine. Yeah, but this is a super rich country. Super rich? Yeah. No, I think it's the system, bro. No, no, this machine could be expensive. It's, people cleaning is cheaper. Oh no, but but imagine machines and people. Man, we need machines, man. So you tell me a country like let's say for example a whole Kenya cannot afford two machines like that to clean to it's clean a big. Enough. Huh? It's not enough. All I'm saying is, man, let's learn from other people. You see, they are watering. Hey, hey. See, right there? They are watering. Look. Ah, serious countries. Have you seen something there? What? They are watering that, man. They are watering, imagine. They want to make their place look like heaven. When you come here, you feel like, wow, I don't want to go back to my home. I want to just stay, stay here, you know? Uh -huh. Wow. Okay. And there are buses, man. Very chill. 
So this is the old town. This is the old town of Luxembourg. And as I already told you, the population here is over 600,000 people. Just a chill vibe town. People crossing casually in the streets, eh, riding bicycles. Even me right now, I'm walking in the long lane. Yeah. Well, let's move this way back. Yeah, this is for the bicycles. Yeah. <laughs> people should walk here, you see? <laughs> Maro in Europe, man. You know, we have a village boy. <laughs> This guy was born in Europe. How do you feel living here, man, in Europe? It's, it's normal, you know, nothing special. But I met you in Mexico, man. Why do you leave Europe for Mexico? I, and, and people want to come to Europe. I think, uh, I think here you can, in many countries, you have to hustle. Yeah, like, hustle. Yeah, yeah. Like in Mexico, I saw a 10 years old boy. It was 10 o'clock in the night. And yeah. He was in a restaurant. He was singing song, playing guitar. Yeah. You need money to feed the family. Yeah. Here you don't need to do that. The government will take care of you. Wow, bro. Look how people just chill. And the sun is shining today. Very beautiful, bright day, man. Wow. Luxembourg. Yeah. So for me, if governments behave like this, I'll be okay with governments. They can do whatever they want. If they do roads like this, they paint, they drive bicycle. They show where people are walking, people are crossing and they are waiting. They, you see, yeah. there is no car, but they have to wait. Yeah. That's now called discipline. You see now, time to cross. Cars will stop, people will cross. Let's go and we'll take a picture with the flag of Luxembourg, man. Hey, hey, let's go. I think we missed. Yeah. We are late. But, but you can, there is also uh, a flag there. Uh, look, there's one right here, bro. Huh? Like this one. This is the bigger one. Okay, there's a bigger one. Let's go to the bigger one. Imagine that level of discipline. Bicycles have their lanes. Cars have their lanes. Buses have their lanes. Trams. Wow. And also here there's a forest to ensure the environment is always green. It fills Europe and big houses and castles. Wow. There we are. We will arrive at the main square. Okay. And then you can take a really great picture there. Wow. No, I remember it. It's really like the clean. It's super clean. Wow. No, these people are serious. Look, even the tree. Yeah. They give it space to grow. Yeah. Enough space. And they paint for it. They man. Sometimes I go crazy when I watch. I see these things like this. Where to go in? Wait until the, you go to Switzerland. It's a richer place. Oh, Switzerland. Yeah. It's something else. Yeah, it's another level. Wow. Guys, I wanna say please give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, man, support your boy I Amaro as I take you around the world. Now we are doing Europe. Remember, we've done already Asia, we've done South America. But this time, if you've not subscribed to the channel, man, subscribe to the channel and also we're gonna be moving very fast from one country to another, like quick, 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 like hey. Wow, let me see this. People are just chilling down there, you see? Just a beautiful, this is like a park, right? Yeah. We're just chilling, nice, having a talk. Yeah, we can walk there a little. Wow, man, and long buses. These are the buses we need, man, in Africa. Yeah. And I feel like it's not very populated, you know? No, this it's not. It's a small town, but a city, but again, or country. It's a country and city and everything is inside. But again, it's not populated because like that group is tourists. Wow. Look at this. The weather feels amazing, right? Yeah, the weather is good. It's summertime. Yes, it's summertime. Luxembourg. My friend. Travel you the world. That oh. Is yeah, this is really, really big flag. Wow. Travel the world and see for yourself what you can see. Wow. Guys, we are one hour away from France, from here, and also one hour away from Germany, and one hour, for, one hour away from Belgium. So anywhere we decide, we yeah. can go. Yeah. Hey, this looks like real streets, like more crowded. But yeah, let's. We, we can go. We can go there and then take the time. Wow, is that gold? That looks like gold on top there. It could be right. I don't know. Because how can a rich country like this put something fake on top there? You know? I mean, it's not real gold. 
Why? Well, maybe it is, I don't know, I have no idea. Imagine a rich country like this putting in fake gold. I don't know guys if you can see on top there. Okay, let me take some pictures for Instagram. So guys, this is the flag of uh, Luxembourg. So I'm told like, from, from my research is, uh, the flag was actually inspired by the French. Like this country copied France somehow. And the red represents uh, red, which is uh, blood all over the world. It's always like that. Anything which is red, uh, red in the in flags, it's always about blood and people who died during war. White represents peace, same as my home country, Kenya. And the other one, which is blue, is an inspiration from France. Yes. Look at that bridge. I don't know if you guys can see right there. Even kids out here have, have come to join. And I want you guys to see how clean this place is like very clean man and look at the tram eh? it really feels europe man look at the tram passing over the bridge you can imagine even building that bridge that's crazy bro wow and there's a guy riding below it with a bicycle i've seen that too all right louis man let's go yeah, louis let's go. are you surprised how maro is surprised to be here yeah i'm surprised yeah, because yeah. for us we live here it's nothing special <laughs> it's a small boring town with nothing to do nothing to see. but maro is so excited you're wondering what's wrong with this guy man yeah what does that tell you sometimes maybe things you take for granted are not always for granted yeah maybe but yeah the thing is that so many places many places look the same when you travel when you stay here many years you will find out that many places look the same and so like this place looks like where? There's a Jaguar here, very beautiful. This place looks like where now? It looks like a bit Geneva. Geneva, Switzerland. Yeah. Wow. I've never been there. Okay, so what's the plan? You know, you, you the guy who decides, look where we just came from. We are in Luxembourg. Beautiful, beautiful country to be. Very small. The capital is, is Luxembourg and the city is Luxembourg. Everything is Luxembourg. Everything Luxembourg. Transport system looks and bad. Money, euro, that's the only thing. So most of these countries, you know, they were never colonized because these people are colonizing other people outside Africa. Look, people, this is a, a BMW followed by Mercedes Benz, followed by a small one called Smart. Maybe it's electric, it does not emit anything. Wow, let's go, man. Looks and bad. Uh, I think people live here, uh -huh, for example, for example, Zurich is uh, is one of the richest city in the. This city is really rich, okay? Yeah. But you go to Zurich, twenty percent of the population of Zurich is multimillionaire, which wow. is not the case. Here. So in the street you will see Ferrari, Lamborghini, Mercedes. You will not see small car like here. <laughs> <laughs> so when you go to Zurich and then you come back here, you say, ah, okay, okay. I see your point, man. So I need to go to Zurich. Yeah. And you told me I can I can take a bullet bullet train. You can take the train from Brussels to Basel, yeah. to Switzerland. Yeah, it's a couple of hours, and then from Basel you can travel all of, all over Switzerland. Wow, bro, we're exploring here a very beautiful uh, city center, old city center. This is how their old houses look like. They look so nice. People, old buddies meeting here, saying hello to each other, and Maro is taking you through the streets, man. Really amazing. I, I, I love this. I, I hope one day our countries will always be like this. And you know what makes this less corruption? When people see community beyond themselves, because most people in governments, maybe in Africa, they just want to take, 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 and build their home just around their home. But this is common good. Somebody can ride a bicycle like this and feel at home. See, I don't know what she's carrying. Another one can push a kid and still feel nice. Others can walk like this and still feel wow. And also Maro here can enjoy. So this is sell the food of really high quality. You can check the price, it's really high. High quality? Yeah. Let's check, it's called? No, you know, we know chemical and stuff. No chemical and stuff? Yeah. So let's see the prices, nine euro? The first price I've seen, kilo per kilo. Wow, let's see something very common that you can find here and in Africa. Let's see, which one? Avocado. Yeah, let's see an avocado. What can we see? This? Patat. 
potatoes, no? Yeah, potatoes. So like this, how much are they selling? Four euro. The Four euro per kilo. Four euro fifty. Oh, uh, add avocado. Tomatoes. Four euro. Five euro. A kilo. Where is it? It's right here. Yeah. Tomatoes. Wow, this is the cost of living, man. It's crazy. Wow. I wanted something like very common, like mango, you know, no, or no banana. Mango, yeah. I've, I've seen bananas over there. Do you, do you want us to buy some bananas? No, I have bananas. Oh, you have bananas? Yes, yeah, <laughs> if I saw you in Puerto Rico, you don't know bananas. Banana is a man's food. Oh, wow, 16, 16 euros, 17 euros for 1 kg. Damn, bro. Hey, here is no joke. Gucci stores. You know, in the streets, just feeling. I'm so happy for that kid who was born here, man. He has, he has a better life. Turkish. Huh? Turkish restaurant. Turkish everywhere. restaurant. Oh, yeah, you told me. You told me Turkish restaurants are one of the cheapest in Europe, right? Yeah, they're everywhere in Europe and they're good price. Wow. Look how the streets look like, guys. Only in Switzerland, uh, Turkish restaurant is expensive. Only in Switzerland? Yeah, yes. Yeah, because you said Switzerland is a very expensive country, yeah, right? It's, 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 how do they make their money? You know, that's another question because I can't sometimes it's too expensive. Like an avocado, you can get somewhere for for one dollar. They are selling it twenty dollars. Why? You know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you know, if you make uh, two thousand euro in Switzerland, you are poor. You know. Oh. If you make two thousand euro, you're under the poverty level. Two thousand euros. Yeah, it's not enough. To yeah, because make. because maybe you because pay. Because the hand, I, I you live there for a while. Yeah. And my hand was to almost two thousand euro. I'm going there. Let's let's today talk about this beautiful country here called Luxembourg. You know one thing I've realized? Actually babies are being born here like crazy. You've realized many people pushing babies or working with babies? Actually every corner I've realized that. You know, I think people come to places like this. Imagine minimum you can earn. I feel like this street has more vibe or we just go and see. Like like minimum minimum you can actually Minimum amount you can earn, let's say you're a security guard, here is 2,300 euros. Yeah. And what about Belgium? Belgium is, is poor compared to here. Belgium minimum wage is 1,200. One thing I don't know is, can you, can you actually work within the European, European Union? This yeah. is part of the European you, Can you move, for example, you yeah. from Belgium and come and live here and work? Yeah, I was about to do this, I told you. Oh. I was about to move there in 2000. So legally you can do it, there's no problem. Yeah. You see, that's the thing I realize about Europeans. They always make their lives easier. Man, I'm telling you, I'm moving from one country to the next like a joke. It's like crossing my river to somebody's next land and I don't have to tell them I'm there. Like here we just arrived casually in a train. And let's see how much they are selling their food, man. So this is food here, okay? No drink, wine. So drink, only, drink. only drinks. Five euros, so you can afford. So for a Fanta, you guys remember Fanta? Fanta is 4.2. Coca-Cola that we know is 4.2. Euros, guys, euros. Fanta that we buy in my home, 20 euros. Now, in my home, imagine in my home, mm -hmm. A Fanta yeah. is like uh, 20 cents, yes. euros, yeah. which is around half a dollar, right? Yeah. Here, they are selling it 4.20 euros. That's close to a Fanta, one Fanta. Fanta yeah. yeah. Only King Burger is cheap, 10 euros. That's, and, it, that's too much. And, and, they give, and they give you a Coca-Cola for free. So if you go to Switzerland, yeah. Burger King will be much expensive than this. Oh. Can you imagine? Man, look how people live here, man. So what, just calm. The restaurant there. Yeah. And then you know the guy like this with the, that cell? Yeah. It was, one of them was the ex-boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow, Because man. the town is so small, you always meet. Meet. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm really eager to see the Tinder, how it works here, maybe later, maybe that's a video. Maybe it doesn't work. Maybe it doesn't work because there are less people here. Wow. 
This is Luxembourg, a population of uh, uh, 640 or 650,000 people live here. It's a country ruled by a king, a prime minister, a, you can vote. It has all types of uh, government systems. As I was saying, there are many kids being born. Look at this. There's a kid there. There are two here. It's so everywhere. Look, the other side also. Man. So we are so close to France that many people that work here, they yeah. don't live here because it's expensive to okay. go in France. Wow, bro. Yes. Yeah. I'm seeing even this, 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 this guy here. The wife, I wish I could interview him, but let's just let's walk and see what's going on. Oh, this, they have twins. Huh? Those two guys. No, it's not twins, but two kids. Man! Bro, I want babies now. Yeah. I wow. you know many African women come here to meet a rich husband. To to meet to make a rich husband. Yes. Here. Yeah. Oh, this is the place. Yeah. Oh. Right here, so when you will see many, many, we will see many very beautiful African women because here they can find a really good husband. Super rich. Yeah. There's money everywhere here, man. Wow. Those are top secrets from my mate here, man, giving me information that if I was walking alone, I will not tell. And nice restaurants, you can actually come here and chill and just enjoy yourself. And also, if you don't have too much money, you can chill like this two couple here and just enjoy, you know, a casual uh, outdoor chill. This is Marwa, man. A little bit surprised by the beauty of Luxembourg, the most beautiful city, I would say, in Europe. Very casual, very nice, and everything looks just nice. Can you see any dirt? Everywhere you see, you can ask me for money or not. Let me go here. Hey, hey, I'm telling you. Uh, welcome to Luxembourg, where it's, it's free transport. I'm filming with my camera and I'm also filming with my... Sorry guys, I was making a live stream here. You can see. We have uh, 159 people watching. We want to try their tram for free. Let's see if it's free, okay? Wow. We go through the city. Wow. Beautiful city, eh? Remember, I am traveling for free. Okay? Welcome to Luxembourg. I'm traveling for free. Not just me, but everybody is in this train is, is traveling for free, okay? Hey, hey. I'm gonna get off right here. In the next station. This is Farah. Chilling. Very amazing here. I need a cameraman. Huh? Luxembourg. The most beautiful city. And the security is it's very very good here. Okay. So I'm taking you along with me in the best ride you can have and the best city of Europe, the richest of all. So let me get out. Okay. I just got out, I have too many things in my hands. So now, I wanna look for the whole country. Yeah, well, whole Luxembourg. But uh, if you are going um, like uh, Here what he's Germany, saying? Yeah. or no. France or Belgium, no. there you have to pay. Okay, once you, if you are going international, because the system does not operate yeah. internationally, you have to pay. Yeah. And, but for the bicycles, you have to pay also. Yeah, this one you have to pay. But uh, bus, tram... Uh, yeah, bus, tram uh -huh. and train. 
is free. It's free. You are from here? Yeah, I'm local here. Yeah. Oh, you're local, man. Yeah. I'm doing actually a video of your city, man. Yeah, I'm YouTube, seeing that. On my YouTube channel. Maybe it's, it's, it's... Nice to meet you all. Man, are people so rich here, bro? So, rich? Uh, yeah, because, you know... Yeah, the that's streets. like a cliche. cliche. That's like a cliche. Uh -huh. um, you see some people who have money. Yes. Do the, the banking stuff and all that. Oh. But uh, we still got also a lot of people who are struggling. Oh. Um, live here or like man with all these nice roads like this how can people struggle man i know i'm uh, I, I mean like everything is getting look, more expensive look you know? how they are cleaning their streets man rich <laughs> country in the world yeah uh, I, I mean get a good pay yes. but the thing is like everything is so expensive especially oh. like the rent like the housing rent they are it's very expensive Wait, yeah. so somebody actually told me. I hope this yeah, car goes away. Please, I hope, I hope, I hope this guy passes away. They are cleaning their feet. Whoa! So they do this all the time? No, not all the time, but mostly, yeah. But it's good for my video just to show people how, how like, here they don't look for people to clean. They have yeah. like machines to do. Yeah, yeah, we have that. Man, what is the minimum pay for a job here, man? Minimum, minimum. pay? Yes. Uh, let's say I get a job today, let's say working in a, let's say working in a shop. Yeah, the minimum wage will be yes. like 2,200. That is like the minimum wage. 2,300 euros. Yeah, but still like people are struggling with that amount of money. Yeah, because the thing is everything else is expensive. Food Especially is expensive. Especially like the housing renters. <laughs> What's a one bedroom, bro? Here, one bedroom. One bedroom. One bedroom, you yeah. can expect like 900 euros. 900 euros. That's like really like expensive. If you like compare it with other countries, yeah. that's like too much. You know? 900, one bedroom. Yeah. Is education free here, bro? No, what? Education. Education. Ed education um, is mandatory. Um, free. But uh, you can drop out at college, but it's not like... No, no, I mean, I mean public, public. Is it free? Yeah, it's free. And uh, university? No, I mean no, primary, is not free. primary, secondary is yeah. free. But uh, you know what, dude? Yeah. I'm, I'm still got some oh, stuff to right, do. All right, man. Thank you, man. I, I just was <laughs> waiting for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, but th thank uh, you so much. Three minutes. Yeah, no problem. Then man, uh, maybe check my YouTube channel so you can see yourself, man. Yeah, okay. You know, of course. Guys, I gotta say thank you so much. Uh, he has been a great guy here, <laughs> randomly in the street. Like a skater guy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, once I saw you with the skate, I knew you were a chill guy, chill vibes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So public transport is free, but not, but not private. Let this guy pass. So they're still cleaning the city, man. Wow, that is his job. Machines. It's just amazing how. Huh? Wow. Guys, please, if you've enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Subscribe to the channel. This is I Amaro in the streets of Luxembourg. And uh, I want to tell you, man, it's just amazing here. And uh, everything is organized. Look, even right here, plastic is put together because they wanna, they wanna. There's another small car right there. I think carrying garbage. These people are so serious here, man. They are so serious. Look, I think this is for the garbage. Yeah, it's garbage. Look, they are so serious. Man, I've never seen some a serious country like this one. It's the richest in Europe. Richest in Europe. <laughs> Man, when you travel around the world, you see crazy things. And uh, now I'm getting lost. Maybe I go back and use the main road. Okay, let me use the main road because otherwise I'll, go, I'll, I'll get really lost. Let me go this way and use the main road. Man, when you travel around the world, you see a lot of things. Somebody says, no, Maro, there is transport tax we pay. Oh, this is somebody from Luxembourg. I'm doing a live stream here for those guys who are watching this. I'm doing a live stream here. We have close to 300 people watching. But me, I would prefer we pay like that than just waking up and, and prices are just high. You know, other countries, they do that. You wake up in the morning and you can't even afford going to school because it's very expensive. So, one thing I've loved the most is this tram, is the best. 
really really good okay so so in front of you that's the library you see right there this other side is kind of one of the main squares here of Luxembourg okay let's go this way now from here I start getting lost I think I should go straight this way otherwise I'll get lost yes wow you know I'm supposed to meet a friend of mine who is somewhere and I'm hoping where I'm heading to is that somewhere <laughs> yes hey, looks and by beautiful 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 free transportation even if they take tax money how many countries take tax money and they can't provide free transportation I still applaud these people and one thing I've learned about Europeans is they try to make their lives as easy as possible they, they don't like to make their lives difficult you know wow look at that very very beautiful man wow just beautiful 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 guys I wanna say thank you so much for watching my live stream today thank you for everybody who donated to the channel thank you for everybody that at first we tried making the live stream and it didn't work but you guys still came through you never left I wanna say thank you so much and I really 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 appreciate you know it's just amazing hey what's up yeah those guys were fearing the camera but I'm telling you it's been so nice look at their buses just amazing you know and the architecture here this was kind of Hebrew even I was wondering what this is you know it's written in Hebrew I don't know if this is Hebrew or it's their language please somebody explain which language is this huh something something very very unique you know somebody explain what this is but it shows 1940 to 1945 I think this is during world wars because there's something like a cross I don't know if you can see there's like a cross right there okay wow so let me go meet my friend I, I know he's been waiting for me he's feeling really tired of me now it's like this guy is not serious but again I I have to do what I have to do man maybe this is uh, the problem to work with a youtuber the richest country in the world So we just arrived uh, back in Brussels, Belgium. Mm -hmm. How many hours does this train take? Three hours. Three hours. It's kind of slow, right? Yes. It's kind of but it is what it is. You should help this lady here. Help me. Help her. Man. Yeah, we help you. Yeah. Maybe even I should help the small one. Let's go. Yeah. I can help a small one. Thank you. Alright, don't worry. So guys, um, I think tomorrow we're going to explore the city of Brussels and uh, Luxembourg was really nice. It was really, really, really nice. Amazing city.
at yeah. the Griffith Observatory in Los Angeles. So I'm officially saying goodbye to Japan. As you see, sir, welcome to Japan. Where is Elisa? Soy de España. I'm heading to.